Hello everybody, welcome to Carrots Gaming. I'm your host Carrots. Today I'm back at it again with some more Empire at War. This time playing Awakening of the Rebellion, which is my favorite mod. So if you guys didn't see my community post, unfortunately while I was clearing up some space on my last campaign to free up some room for more recordings, I accidentally deleted the save for my campaign, my hut campaign. I was really sad about it because I wasn't sure if this would properly run on my computer and I'm actually really happy that it did because that was this was the kind of the backup plan but I'm happy that it does run we are playing as the rebellion so let's immediately oh my god it's like actual proper cells I love that about this map it's like there's actual freaking cells here do we own Lethal? we do own Lethal. it's like actual proper cells and this shit's like Phoenix Squadron. It's so cool. I love it so much. I love this mod. Okay. We need to get everything. We need to consolidate our fleets. This world, I'm selling everything on it unless it's not, unless it's worth keeping. Build ground mining facilities. Can I build ground mining facilities? I don't think I can. Yeah, no, I can't. Manufacturing base, that's so tempting, but unfortunately, not worth at all. We're gonna ship our forces though. Let's go to space. Can I sell my space station? I can't. Damn it. So, something I'm going to do first of all, immediately, I want tech. I know it's a really early to go into tech, but I want the tech. Let's put that on, I don't know, Luthal seems like a good place. And no, not really, because if they take the BIM, yeah, Moncala is probably best for it. Let's look at all of our options, though. Um, Hoth would be pretty good. But I know there's a mission to take it, so not that great. All right, let's put you on there. Ooh, also, this is a completely new GUI. Holy shit, I didn't even realize. Wait a minute. This is a completely different UI than I when I last played this mod. Holy crap. Oh, that's cool. Oh no, I want you guys to stay there. And I want you guys to move over here. What? We get an MC40? That's cool. Anywho, let's move all of our forces to Sly Marith. That way we can be ready for you immediately get a defense station, a proper one. I need to hold on to Raxus Prime. Generate combat puzzles, generate for placing a certain Raxus Prime. That's pretty cool, a large factory, okay. Okay. Send this fleet to here. This fleet to here. This fleet can stay right where it is. But we are gonna pause again. We're gonna be pausing a lot, so just get used to it. Move that to there, pause. Especially in the early game. So I'm gonna wanna move you to a different sector to reinforce it. I'm hoping to get to the Yavin sector, but it, I wouldn't be upset if it went here, but I don't think it will. Yeah, I'll definitely go here. I'm gonna go to Concordant, and then I'm gonna book it back to there. Is how I'm gonna run this operation. Um, oh, I have a MC-75. This is one of my favorite capital ships of the Rebellion. And I feel like it's really underutilized because people use it a lot during the early game and then they just kind of stop using it. I feel like it's very useful even in light game because it's a, it's a big old disabler boat and it's a torpedo boat, you know what I mean? So first of all, pause again. As a main station can build, ooh, Tuscan fighters. Hey, I like these things. These are like really decent interceptors. Let's grab one or two. Sensor ray station, that'll be good to get. Wait, do we just get R41s everywhere? We do. Interesting. I feel like I don't use these enough. These are pretty good. 
Corvettes and frigates stand little chance to dogfight, beasts and children, seek the warheads. Yeah, these are these are pretty good against the Corvettes and such. Okay. You have that. Okay, so we should move all of these forces. Or move this actually up to here to create. I feel like would be a wise decision. Because these guys won't spread. These guys aren't gonna attack. Navarro, ooh. Build Grand Mounting Facility, it's interesting. Now, I feel like this is my biggest fleet here. With enough power to kind of hit the Empire because it's actually got artillery support and a proper capital ship. You don't have anything, do you? You have basically no stations, holy crap. You're not bordering anything, so I'm not too worried, but wish. You already have one. Not really worth holding you on the air, I must say. So let's get a shield generator on the ground. Oh yeah, and Hoth does not need this. Hang on, sell this for some additional funds. Hoth doesn't need that at all. Okay, so let's move both. I'll keep the ground forces on just because Let's move all of you guys to Othwa, but really quick, I want to send the envoy somewhere. Um, can I send the envoy anywhere? Because I'll definitely put it on Hosanna Prime, because they're not going to be... I can't, damn. Alright, let's go and slap this on fucking Coruscant. It's pretty much useless, but hey. And we'll move you to here, you to here. Retreat the forces that are here to there. Get these guys into a group and move up to there. And then pause. This is still moving around. It's gonna get to there, that's good. You're gonna stay there for now as a defense fleet. Let's get this guy retreated, start moving you, because it's going to be fucking slow as shit, so might as well start. Okay, so once that's done, I think we should try to immediately push this sector. Oh, hey, hello. I didn't even realize I had this. Interesting. Come in here. What can, what do you got for me exactly? 15% cheaper. Ooh. Nice. What the hell do you even have? You're a Corvette. You're a Picket. You're a, I think a, almost like a Hammerhead freaking Nebulon B. Yeah, you know what? Reinforces on the ground. Reinforces planet, yeah, actually, hell yeah. Let's hold a planet in the middle of their, let's hold this planet. I know it seems kind of dumb right now, but hey, if we can do it, I might as well, you know what I mean? Get you up into the ground, the main fleet. You move to here, you move to there. Then you just go to freaking Hapes and try and deal with that shit. While I move, ooh, hello. We're gonna move this fleet here, Kashyyyk. Get one of these and a shield generator. And then I'd be pretty honestly pretty happy. We're running out of credits. Oh my god, speed hang on, whoa, 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 whoa. The tech is down here. So you no longer run into the problem of not being able to see what the fuck's going on. That's so cool actually. And Cordon? Oh. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember now. Okay, um, where is this? Concord down here. So we're retreating from the planet right now. Get this battle started. Do not really care about the formation because we are literally just running. Oh, we do have our 41s. Let's take a look at these guys. 
Oh, dude, those look so cool. Oh, these are like the... Oh, yeah, these are like the snub fighters from Mandalorian, I think. Then what the hell is this? Interesting. I don't think you have any weapons, do you? You have one weapon. And then this guy... What do you actually... You have light... You have long range. No, you just have regular light dual TLs. You used to have long range TLs, and you were kind of like a really cheap, almost artillery ship. Okay, let's get the hell out of Dodge. Wait, are these ours? Oh, that's cool. Hang on. Oh, we should we should have harassed them and seen if we could destroy something. Oh, I hope you don't just go back to here. Oh, that would be really stupid. I didn't even think about that. You could easily just go back to there. That was kind of dumb. No, it is. It's actually going to there because it, it recognizes this is the closest planet. Hell yeah. So they will be getting a reinforcement at Yavin. Yavin, actually, I want you to move all your forces to here because that's kind of where you're going to be attacked, to be honest. Make a move to consolidate this fleet as well. What are you actually rocking? You got this guy, you got him. Okay, that's not terrible. I mean, it kind of is. Let's get a fleet together and see exactly what you're missing. Okay, pause. Let's try and... Can we even get into a battle yet? Do we have enough forces here? Absolutely not. We have two squadrons of fighters. Holy crap. Do I actually have any? I don't, do I? Interesting. I'm going to put the money into that right now. Just because I want it. And then you, you know what? Lothal. We're going to pull a Thrawn and put a fighter shipyard on your planet and then sit down into here can you take anything what would happen if we, we would be bordering yeah that's too big of a fleet for this guy it's only a 36 what do you an 18 actually i wouldn't mind taking this then we could take lodia you know what i mean kind of take a planet from the Interesting, and yeah, that's a really weak fleet. We actually might be able to do that. Okay, so I want you to move up to here and be reinforced by this fleet here so we can see what our forces look like and what we're lacking. Or this Mimban, you're kind of off on your own. Mimban Freedom Fighters, whoa! Hang on, the hell are you guys? What are you, rangers? Ooh, so basically kind of like snipers. That's cool, actually. I love that, that we can recruit those. What's here? A world that is very close to being dead, but I think you're gonna be able to survive because of the independent factions. What do you have here, exactly? Decent fleet, actually. Let's move you here. All the fighters count. And then we definitely need to make sure we have best bin. So let's get our forces together over here. Okay, um, move out to here, move out to here, get to there because I don't really care because this is our world here. Fantastic, we got the orbit. Let's take the ground. Skip that. Now we have him, which he's an actually interesting hero to work with because he can summon in a random ship. That's his ability. That's such a cool ability. 
Because you could call in like an extra fighter squadron, a tiny corvette, or a freaking Corillian destroyer. And I love this dude for that specific reason. Okay. So that's that taken care of. I might want to go down and hit all these worlds, so I'm going to take plus Misa if I can. So, oof, but we're bordering all these worlds. Actually, unless there's a particular reason that I think I can hold these, I might just run. You have turbo lasers. You're going to hold on on the ground. Except for you. I won't want you for your support. Okay, join up here with the main fleet. As a main station, I'm definitely fucking holding. Get that, and then I'm gonna give you one of these guys. This is my strongest. Yeah, this is my strongest that I have. So I'm gonna get one of those, and then definitely get one of these once I have the money for it. Move out to here. Here and then what's your ground force look like? Minuscule. So we're gonna move this ground force to join up with the ground force on the ground there. And what does our ground force on the ground here look like? Not terrible. We do have a main battle tank. That's pretty good. Okay, got all that. We should try getting into a battle now. And I think this will be my first target. Or Navarro. We'll take this first, then we'll have choices. But I definitely think Ord Platoon is going to... Or Ord Pana, or whatever it is, is going to be my target at the moment. We have good fleet, we have good fleet, we do. Lacking in the fighter department. Actually, lacking in the bomber department. What kind of fighters do you get? Jack Italy, you actually get two C ninety fives, one arc squadron. That's not terrible. Do you get any fighters? No. You get Z ninety fives. We do have gunships. We just are lacking a bomber support. So that should be something we build over on Camino because it's kind of away from everything. Build us fighters. Oh, Espen, while we have the money, before I forget, build that immediately. We need that, that station online. Do I have any other planets that can do that? I have to make sure that all my planets, Antar can do that, right? And build Tabana gas refineries. I need to see what they have on this planet. Oh, we have Umbra. We can get these guys. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. Interesting. You almost got that done. You almost got this done. Hello there. Hi, Royal Battle Dragon. Am I poking a bear's nest by doing this? I want you to bake me money, but I guess you don't want to. Stylish a course up. Hey, you finally got there. Gathering every holy crap, that's actually not bad. Okay. What is our target? Is this definitely our target? Yeah. All right, we're gonna move out. Good dear, we're gonna get to Yavin real quick. Has our reinforcements properly arrived? How's this fleet looking? Why the hell do you have? Oh, no, that's my fault. Never mind. Put you on the ground here. Corrupting. Condescent six set Erdris. Where the fuck is Erdris? First of all, stop that insubordination. We gotta figure out a way to remove that corruption immediately. And we're gonna do that by sending this guy over to there, because I'm not too worried about corruption over here. We're not really bordering any worlds. Where's Eridurus now? Hello? Eridurus. 
Where are you? You're supposed to have a... I don't know where this is. Shouldn't there be a thing? Maybe I didn't let it get time to spawn. There should be a thing telling me where it is. Unless I made... Oh, it's right here. Okay. Hey, I can actually do that. I think I have stealth unit in this fleet, don't I? No, I don't. What am I talking about? Stop it. Uh, let's go to tech tree really quick. What do I, when do I get my tech tree? Do I get... Oh, that's... Oh, no, that's space unit, right? If it's actually take... Let's see here. Oh, yeah, base units. Okay. So we're going to be getting that in a second here with this. How many weeks do I get with that? Seven weeks. That's not a lot. We should send somebody over there immediately. Or we're just going to have to let that... What, what's our... Hang on, what's... What's the reward for this? Just money? Yeah, just money. Yeah, I mean... Yeah. That's pretty worth it, actually. Okay, we're gonna pause. How close are you? We're very close. Oh, hey. No, never mind. Okay, so we're getting that up. Chandrilla? We're selling this. Everything. Sell. Everything. You are not worth holding. In any amount. Do you give us income? Yeah, you do. We'll keep that. Until. Or do you make us. Yeah, you make us income. We're just gonna do that. But yeah, this planet. Not worth holding in the slightest. Um, that's right, I wanted to send you. Can I do it quickly? Pause. Grab. Remove the corruption. Hey, that's perfect timing. Alright, let's get this battle started. Alright, let's get this battle started. So we get long probes from this, right? If I remember correctly, unless they changed it. Oh, thank God. Okay. Let's start heading out. Let's actually have you move on ahead. I don't actually know where these guys are. What's here? Just the asteroid belt? I don't know, what the hell are you? Those look fun. Okay, that's... So don't fly through there. What's your armament look like? You have one light TL, heavy laser cannons, and then light laser cannons. Okay. That's pretty good. Are you just here? Move independently. Okay, we're just gonna pick this up right now. Grab this too, will be our first units in. And then we're just gonna have these two units move up to here. Have one of you guys rush over to there. We're capping this already. Well, what's here? What the hell is here? It's weird. Oh! We have... Contact! With a... Mirror Cruiser? Eddie Cruiser? And a Hunter? Ish. What are you doing way over there? Capture this. No, capture that, please. Do as I tell you, not as you wish. We've captured this, right? Yes, okay. Drop big ships out. 
<laughs> well, that's right, Captain Shack. That's Captain Shack's ship, isn't it? Get that ship out there. Spread some of this out here. Let's bring out our fighters. I'm not gonna bother with our bombers. Do we actually own this finally? No. How do you not own this yet? Okay, this is just getting ridiculous. Engage. Engage, you're about to freaking die. Have this go help you, I guess. Okay, we have fighters, so let us zoom in. Group one, move out. We're gonna have interceptors move in independently. Group two, pick and choose your target. Start dealing with those bombers. Then group three, will be these guys, group three. And you guys just, do you have any more purple weapons? No, but you'll be good against pretty much anything else that tries to attack with your bunches and bunches of freaking flak cannons and concussion missiles. You guys are gonna be a group. Let's group three. That's group three. Okay, so you guys are gonna be group four. So that's pretty much destroyed. I am gonna wanna have you guys focus on that. Get closer. Please. Ooh, that's gonna suck. Deal with those? Okay, now deal with those, please. Start dealing with them. How is group one doing? Group two? Group three? How are you holding out? Engage that, don't just let it walk all over you. Okay, now group three, come down and help reinforce. You have boost to shields, do you have anything else? I think you have flak, don't you? Yeah, you have black. Oh, this is actually super freaking cool. Let's zoom the hell in and get to the screenshots. Oh, it looks so cool. I fucking love this mod. Just look at this thing. Look how pretty it is. Look how pretty it is. What are we shooting at? Group three, a bunch of hunters. So we can go deal with them. Group four. Start dealing with those, actually. Oh, get the hell out of here. Get the hell out of here. Move by this. Group three. Engage. Boom, we are victorious. Hells to the yeah. And we actually got that built. Oh, that was fun. I kinda I missed this combat. I missed this. Because don't get me wrong, Fall of the Republic is awesome, but I miss the meticulous little, like, you have to fucking micromanage every single thing or you will lose. Like, even in that combat, if I didn't focus on those bombers, I would have lost probably, like, one of my capitals. Which, at this point, I am counting my dreadnoughts as capitals at this point. Because we're so early game and we have so few capital ships that they are technically the main brunt of my firepower. I'm just gonna shoo you on over there, see what's going on. What do you give us? Increased protection military or increased due to villains, negative negation of technology. Ooh. So it's kind of a sucky world. But background. 
Acra is a good one because we can build Acra shipyards, which means we can build Acra destroyers, which those are always fun. Alright, I think that's going to be it for this episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this kind of content, please like and subscribe. If you want to see more content like mine, go check out my brother's channel. My cousin will be streaming again soon, so keep a lookout for her channel in my description. I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!